submissive. Oh. I'm different. I don't want submissive. I, I don't think submissive is that big of a deal for me. All right, you all are. That Somebody is. has a lead. You're looking for a partnership. Yeah. Somebody has to lead. What is leadership really, right? Leading because is knowing what you, how, what areas to lead in. I can think of an example where the husband was the provider, but the wife managed the finances in a very detailed, responsible manner. Like, she was more financially literate, more financially savvy, more financially responsible. So although he was the breadwinner, he knew he had absolute trust in his wife to the point they didn't have separate bank account. Is he, he's still being a leader in his household. He's being yeah. a breadwinner, but he's not managing his finances. Like I said, y'all, I believe in partnership and I believe in, you know, you do part of things and I do part of things. Now, if there's something you are smarter at than I am, then of course, help me. But I also feel like if your wife knows things you don't, if you're going to shun her or I'm a man or I don't this, I don't that, why are y'all even in this together? You know what I mean? That's like watching somebody struggle and you just go, hmm, he's got it. No, you don't do that when you love somebody. You help them. So if I see your finances are all messed up, I see your credit's messed up, and I know how to fix credit, why wouldn't I help you? That's going to be masculine of me to help my man with his money or his fi- That's crazy. I think people are too used to, you know, having people they can't trust, you know, being around an old partner that, you know, didn't make them feel safe and secure. I get that. But there are some people out here who will do anything and everything to make you feel happy and to help you with things. Please don't push those people away and please don't self-sabotage. And here's my theory. Imagine if a healed man and a healed woman or just a regular guy and a regular girl were very self-aware, knew what they should and shouldn't be doing. You could be together without having to do all this submissive, masculine, dominant. When people belong together and people coexist the right way y'all it works out the way it's supposed to so to me all these labels and all this stuff is dramatic because everybody does different things in their relationship some women handle the finances some men do all of that because they're the ones who make the money whatever works for y'all do what the hell y'all gotta do and if you got a partner who knows a lot more than you and they're teaching you things you better be trying to sit there and listen and retain all that information, especially when it comes to like, you know, money things, how to manage life. Maybe they know about, you know, stuff you just don't know in general. You can always learn something from somebody like don't have such pride and ego that you don't want to learn from your partner. And I say that because there's a lot of men out here who feel like they should have it all together because there's going to be a woman who doesn't care for that. But I feel like men and women both need to coexist y'all like y'all need to learn to help one another stop putting so many labels on things like if she does dishes you do dishes just help each other like it's a partnership i feel like shit would flow more if people believed in equality more than anything now me personally i don't think we're equal but i'm saying in a partnership shit should be equal so that, that way you both can be equally happy at least try damn